Listen up, punk. If there's something you want, spit it out. I'm a busy man, and I haven't got all day. Is that right? Well, what's he after? And I'm supposed to sort the wheat from the shaft? I haven't got time for that. Especially now that some gang's been starting fires around Sen Soji Temple. Boy, I don't know what's going on anymore. But I've got a feeling it isn't going to end well. Point is, I don't have time to be getting mixed up with you. So go and wash your face with miso soup or something. Go and find yourself a local and ask them, all right? That's what I like to hear. But it's going to take more than words to win me over, hmm? There's a whole gang of them starting these fires. So if you can round them up, I might consider helping you. How about it? You think you can catch these thugs? Well, once you've dealt with them, come and see me in the main hall. That's where my men are based. Stay sharp. Time for me to shine, eh?
the help, and I've given your request a lot of thought. I'll get you some soldiers. Here, you can drown a lot of us. That's the way we do things in Edo. I get it. You're no run of the mill samurai. I'll give you that. And you caught those arsonists to boot. I can't very well ignore your request now, huh? Chief Tatsugoro, good to see you again. I believe you know why I've come to visit. I do. You want me to round up a bunch of young folks. Well, your wish is my command. Hundreds of young men with no prospects have come through my care. Many of them are more than willing to take up a good cause. Yeah. You just let him know he can leave everything to me. Thank you for your aid. Leave the rest to me. I'll report back to Katsu. That's fine work. Thanks to you, it looks like we have what we need to revitalize the Shogunate. Now, I had my men look into the samurai you mentioned. Word is they're working for the Brits as an intermediary. Setting up weapon sales with the high and mighty. Something smells rotten, though. And someone in my position can't afford to turn a blind eye. 
In fact, not all the men I sent to investigate have come back. I have to assume the worst. This has grown beyond your pet project. I need to keep looking into this. But let's leave that conversation for another time. I sent the best of the men you gathered to the military academy, by the way. You should take a look at yourselves. Join their training while you're at it. Believe me, there are recruits there who could glare a foreigner into submission. Ah, oh, that sounds interesting. I might go and take a peek right now. See you there, okay? Man of action, isn't he? Now, there's one more favor I'd like to ask of you. Enomoto says we don't have the funds to buy ourselves guns or artillery. When I mentioned this to Mr. Brunet, he suggested we try selling Japanese crafts at the International Exposition in Paris. Viscount Shibusawa, our money man, will know exactly what to do. Will you take this letter and offer him any help he might require? You'll find him at the South Commissioner's office. That's all for now. But don't think I won't ask you for more favors if you come back. Feel free to drop by the military academy first, though. You won't want to miss what's going on there. Thank you for... What can I do for you? I hope we can be of service to you again. Impressive! I wasn't expecting you quite that quick. Truth is, we're being graced with the Shogun's presence today. He's here to observe a little martial arts competition. You'll watch too, won't you? Good! I'll show you inside. This is the shooting range where they teach Takashima style gunnery. A vital skill for these changing times. Here's where they practice horseback archery. Eventually, they'll start learning Western horsemanship too. This is the fencing hall, but it's been converted for the competition. I believe the Shogun should already be here. Hey! Ah! There's Ryoma. Why don't you 
join him and look around together. Ah, you're finally here. I asked if you could enter the competition, by the way. Nothing. I just thought you'd want to. No need to thank me, by the way. I heard the Shogun himself will give you your prize if you win three matches. Can't say the prize isn't appealing. But honestly, I really just want to meet the Shogun in person. They say he's sharp, you know. And sensible, too. So, are you ready to fight? Then off you go! With your skills, you can't lose. Just go mop the floor with them. His name is Teshu Yamalka. We use the same dueling style, and he's very good at it. He's known to be a tough one. They say he can pierce steel with a wooden sword. Then get going. I'm in your corner, remember. Make me proud. train harder. Ah, I knew you could do it. How are you feeling about the next match? Deiju Takahashi, the stepbrother of the man you just fought. He's a master of the Jitoku in Ryu and is so respected for his skill with the spear he was appointed governor of Ise province. Good. Just keep up the momentum from your last fight. I'm counting on you. Your guard. Yeah. Ah. Ah. 
Made it this far. Now you just need to win your next fight. Well, are you ready? A guy by the name of Shigoro Kano. They call him a genius of Jujutsu. He's still just a kid, but underestimate him at your peril. The essence of Jujutsu is that the gentle can defeat the strong. But what that really means is they can throw a guy twice their size across the room. Win this last match, and the prize is yours. I know you can do this. This was an educational experience for you too. May we spar again soon. You did it! The prize is ours! I saw the whole thing. A fine display. 
Now, how about we test those skills in one last bout? Oh boy. Now you want a piece of the action? As long as you don't make us forfeit the prize if we lose. Now, you made short work of Teshu and Deshu. This time, I think I'll start with my sword drawn. Only joking. <laughs> I wouldn't dream of it. But His Excellency did say he would like to witness you fight one more time. Which is why I, busy though I am, have come to make this request. Oh, and His Excellency has requested real swords for the next duel. Your opponent has already given his consent. No two ways about it, your life will be on the line. So, how about we sweeten the pot to make up for it? After all you've been through, you're not scared of real steel, are you? Just one more bout to go, my friend. Ready to go? I know you're going to win whoever it is you're up against. I believe in you! Certainly showed me. Hmm? Ah. Hey, 
Hey, I know you. We met in Yoshiwara. <laughs> Mistaken identity, I am sure. I am Yoshinobu Tokugawa, the Shogun. The Shogun? Are you serious? <laughs> Seems I let the cat out of the bag. We had no intention of disrespecting you, uh, Your Excellency. Hey, <laughs> where are your manners? No need to be concerned. Losing to you was invigorating. Invigorating? <laughs> Indeed. I mean, you dodged the shuriken. Finding warriors like you is no easy feat. Ah, the next bout. With warriors of this caliber, I know I can get Japan back on its feet. I will make our nation the equal of any foreign land. You wait and see. Well, well, you really are something, aren't you? I can't believe you managed to win against His Excellency. Stop kidding around. You must have felt it when you met him. We can't afford to lose a great man like that. Feel free to make use of this place from now on. You need to hone those talents of yours. Do you really intend to obey the Imperial Court's order and go to Kyoto? This is a fine opportunity. Kyoto is where we can find those who wish to topple me and put the Imperial Court in my place. So let's get on the front foot and bring this conflict to an end. You didn't think I meant to go unprepared, did you? Tadamori! Sir. As military commissioner of Kyoto, you will go as my advance guard. You may take your pick of my finest warriors. Your Excellency, allow me to gather an army to defend Kyoto. I shall find you truly worthy soldiers from all levels of society. This is madness! You'll attract scoundrels! You'll open the door to traitors! Let them come. We shall deal with them all in one fell swoop. I leave this to you. My lord, now if you will excuse me. Gatsu says he's got another favor to ask of us. Apparently, it's something he can't ask anyone else. Rearing to go, huh? That makes two of us. I have a feeling Japan's really going to change, thanks to Gatsu and His Excellency. I've got a feeling we're about to be given something big to do. And I, for one, can't wait.
I'll get going first. Let's meet at Katsu's place. Welcome. I'm blessed to have your patronage. What do you need? You got it. I can strengthen anything. Anything else? Later then, and take care! Sorry for the trouble, but there's something I need you to do. Top secret stuff. I'm serious. Not a word to anyone. I take it you heard His Excellency is heading to Kyoto. Well, a group of Ronin, the Roshigumi, has been assembled to act as his escort. They're recruiting the best around, no matter their background. Even a criminal record is no problem. It's a pretty brave move. Lord Katamori. The military commissioner of Kyoto claims it's to give the peasantry the chance to earn a decent living. But, in reality, he's luring the shogun's enemies in so he can wipe them out all at once. He might look like a pretty boy, but he's a sly one. No question. Mm. You shogunate heavyweights come up with all sorts of things. I'm just afraid things might heat up, putting the Shogun in danger. I need people I can trust inside the Roshigumi, to see which way the wind is blowing. How about it? You two would be perfect. We've looked everywhere and there's no sign of them in Edo, which means their likeliest location is Kyoto. Anti-Shogunate forces are amassing there now. I wouldn't be surprised if the Demon Claw turned up as well. No objections here. Sign me up. And what about you? Thanks. I owe you one. Right. The Densuin Temple in Koishikawa is about to be flooded with hopefuls. Head there and report back. We'd better hurry if it's already happening. To Denzelwin Temple.
do what you did for me. Somebody. Not much, but please accept this. Is. So you and Yoma are planning on signing up? Well, you see... Teshu Yamaoka and I are overseeing the Roshigumi. Seems I got a little leg up thanks to you both. Much obliged. Excuse me. I'm Koto Nakazawa. I'm here to join the Roshigumi too. Yes, well, uh, I'm afraid you three will just have to turn around. We've already got so many applicants, you see? 
I heard you were looking for strong warriors. Well, if you think anyone is stronger than me, I'll face them here and now. <sighs> Must they all be like this? Hachiro, we have another fire to put out. Seems those two from before are picking fights with anyone and everyone. You mean those tearaways from the backwater dojo? Guess we've got no choice but to make them settle down ourselves. Please, allow me the honor. But, if I get them to behave, I want in. How's that sound? It's a deal. Honestly, those two have me at my wit's end. If you could deal with them, I would greatly appreciate it. Same goes for you two. Subdue that rowdy bunch inside and you're in. You'll get no favors from me just because I know you. That's the spirit. They were trained out in the sticks, right? Piece of cake. We'll be done before you know it. <laughs> the stronger they are, the better proof of my skill this will be. Let's <laughs> go. 
So that's your specialty. Your time. Is that all? Thanks for your patronage. Let's go. Well, isn't there anyone stronger? You look like you can offer us a bit more sport. Hold myself back! Don't you think? 
Zoji, you're here too, I see. You put on quite a show. This is Soji Okita of the Tenen Rishinryu. I'm Kondo, and this is Ichikata, also of the Tenen Rishinryu. You would do well in our most elite unit, the Roshigumi. Excellent work. Just excellent. I don't doubt it. Sorry for not warning you. That Kondo fellow is known throughout Kanto as a master of the Tenen Dishindu. I'd heard his juniors, Hijikata and Okita, were just as skilled. Guess the rumors were true. I trust you saw how well I fought. I think I more than lived up to my side of the bargain. Uh, you're tough, it's true. All right, the three of you are in. Welcome aboard. Thank you. I'm looking forward to it. All right then. The Roshigumi will soon be leaving to serve as outriders for the Shogun's journey to Kyoto. Make your preparations and come back to the square when ready. Traveled far. Hey, looks like Kondo and the others have turned over a new leaf. They're doing a fine job now, sorting out the regiments. It's incredible how many skilled fighters we've managed to assemble. Now it's up to me to figure out how best to make use of them. Anyways, it's about time we set out for Kyoto. Are you ready? All right. Well, be seen. Like you've got deep pockets. Hey,
Do I know you? Don't tell me. The Ronin from the military academy. You'd think so, but my name is better known than are my features. <laughs> Thankfully, I don't stick out too much. At any rate, I have been looking for a capable fighter like you. Moreover, someone without ties to the Shogunate. You see, it seems that some of my retainers have become involved in shady dealings with a merchant. It was I who disclosed the matter. The same thing happened in Yokohama, remember? I figured that there was something rotten in the state of Edo. At any rate, our friend here should be able to put your man in line. <laughs> Which is why I'd like to procure some irrefutable evidence with this camera. Got it? What a fine idea! Hey, you still have the camera I gave you? That would be the natural course of action, I'm told. But I have no intention of hiding behind my title or my castle walls. Besides, I try not to leave to others what I can do myself. Well, will you help me procure the evidence I need? I'm afraid that calling on a servant would only complicate matters sorely. Good. We'll head out when the alleged deal is set to take place. The Shogunate is big, and it's unwieldy. Even I cannot deal with corrupt officials as I please, and I'm the Shogun. I hear the scoundrels have gone from merely taking bribes to selling arms to the highest bidder, whoever that may be. That's why we need to secure proof. But to be clear, this is not an assassination. This is where the transaction will take place. Let's slip in undetected. Oh! 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 Oh!
Your Excellency! Are you hurt? You mustn't be so reckless! Ah, Your Excellency, is it? Seems we've hooked ourselves a big fish. How come you're here? Master Katsu had us follow you at a distance. If only we had not lost sight of you. Worry not. I'm much obliged. That Katsu. Always one step ahead. I suppose I owe you my thanks as well. I'm afraid I have no idea. All I know is that he single-handedly disposed of my retainers. Get some ninja to look into that old man, will you? I'd prefer to have seen those criminals tried, but I suppose the result would have been the same. Sorry to have troubled you. Ah, it's you. Ah, it's you. Let's have a little chat. Oh, I like this. No problem. I'm always happy to talk. I just posted a letter to my older sister. Have I ever told you about her? When I was a kid, I used to get bullied a lot for wetting the bed. It was always my sister who stood up for me. I'm forever grateful to her for helping me stop that bad habit. Our mother died young, so it was really my sister who raised me. What's your family like? Oh, you too, huh? Seems we both had good people around us. Well, it's our heart that tells us who our family is. Who cares if you're really related by blood? Do you remember Izo Akada? We share no blood ties, but there are times he's felt like my own counterpart. I know he sometimes takes things too far. But to me, he's one of the good guys. From here on out, you're going to be meeting all sorts of people. You're bound to get close to some of them. And before you know it, family. Who knows, maybe it'll even happen to you and me. <laughs> Hey, can we go out for a bit? Let's find somewhere with a good view, shall we? This seems like a good place to talk. Truth is, I've been getting a lot of cold looks from people lately. I guess I see why. We do have connections with both the anti- and pro-shogunate sides. But how can we forge a new Japan if we're bound by social obligation? We're free agents, Ronin, so we need to act like it. They can call me shameless all they want. I've only ever done what I thought was right. Hearing you say that feels like a weight off my shoulders. 
It's not easy to shed social ties for ambition's sake. I admire that about you. I really do. It doesn't come easy to me for fear of others' judgment. But you really don't seem concerned in the slightest. You're like a free bird in a big blue sky. So I'm going to keep moving forward, even if people do talk behind my back. Maybe one day I'll be able to take off and fly up there with you. No, wait. If you're a bird, then I get to be a dragon. <laughs> You'll see me soaring ahead of you one day, I promise. Let's have a little chat. Ah. Later! Busy looking for someone. Can I trust you not to get in our way? Word is a renowned martial arts master is training on this mountain. So we've come to hone our skills. I'd really like to get to Takasugi's level one day. 
My word. Can you not go two minutes without mentioning that man's name? You don't want to talk? You're constantly going, Kusaka this, Kusaka that. Moving on. You hammered us good and proper at Ine's place. We're painfully aware of our need to grow if we're to achieve anything. Hey, I just realized. The martial arts master we're after competed in the tournament at the military academy. Didn't you compete too? If you're already acquainted, would you ask him to let us train with him? Ah, thank you. Much obliged. Over there. Is that him? He looks kind of young. You there? You're not Jigoro Kano, are you? Yes? Can I help you? Ah, I remember you from the military academy! Famed. I don't know if I'll go quite so far. Though I suppose I've received a fair bit of attention since then. And we're acquaintances too. I wonder, would you be so kind as to teach us to fight? You want me to teach you? Hmm. I've had some nasty rumors about Choshu of late, and as a member of the military academy, my hands might be tied. Very well. After all, you did go out of your way to find me. I suppose we could run through a few training exercises. Wonderful. We're very much looking forward to it. There's a place up ahead Alfred used to train. Let's go over there now. This is where I practice my hill sprints, where I run full steam from the base all the way to the top. By using often neglected muscle groups, I strengthen not only my legs, but my entire body. Naturally, it also helps to build stamina. I don't know. This sounds rather basic. Yeah, let's make it interesting. What if we race to see who can reach the top first? All right, time to finally show you who's boss. Master Kano, give us the signal. Very well. But remember, this is training. Ready? Go! I've got this! I can perfectly hold my own here. You! Stand back, Ito! If anyone should stand back, it's you, Yamagata. You Joshu boys are in fine shape. You'll excel in the fighting arts, I'm sure. <laughs> that was a piece of cake. Huh? All right then, let's move on to the next exercise. This is where I like to practice sparring. I want you to face off one on one with another as if you were engaging in a real combat. What technique you choose is entirely up to you. I see. Got any tips before we begin? The success of your training depends on you and your partner. That is, you must approach your fight with a willingness to help each other succeed. Got it. 
Master Kano, it be my honor to train with someone of your caliber. I expect you'd be able to wipe the floor with me, would you not? Yes. Well, I'm afraid you're not quite at my level. But perhaps the three of you could try and take me on together. <clears throat> what? The nerve of this guy! We'll make you eat those words! Come on, Ito! Let's get him! The three of us can take him down! Please come at me however you'd like! You're yeah. fooling yourself if you think you're the best of the three of us! Don't come crying afterwards! I can't believe how much one man made, made a struggle. I underestimated him. I suppose that's what you get from a famous martial artist. If we keep training like that, do you think we could get that strong? I suppose. Shall we get back to it then? I should thank you, too. I appreciate you vouching for us. You're fairly generous yourself, the way I see it. We're going to get stronger. Just you wait. Strong enough to pay back what we owe you one day. You're back! Good! Let's have a little chat. Oh? What? <laughs> I hope you have time, because it's as big as the ocean. But there are still... Uh, some moving parts. Up until now, I've always done what I thought was right. But what exactly that is changes with the spirit of the age. In the end, though, I know I'll make this country a brighter place. That's something I truly believe. Ah. What do you want? Sure, I'm game. What's on your mind? 
The Yokohama Kihetai was something of an experiment, to be frank. I'm thinking I will build a new militia back home. As always, any person with aspiration is welcome no matter their social status. But this time, they will be trained and equipped for Western-style warfare. The age of samurai won't last forever, and new Kihetai would go a long way toward ending it. Hmm. Interesting question there. And not easy to answer. Well, I consider everyone from Choshu to be a true comrade. Kusaka, first and foremost. And I would trust him with my life. But, uh... Having said that, I wouldn't say we get along particularly well. I would say I get along with the Tosa guys, Sakamoto, and Nakaoka much better. Well, it's the domain of the Mori family, made famous by the master schema, Motonari Mori, in the Sengoku period. In Motonari's day, they governed six states as great daimyos, until it went down to two after the Tokugawa beat them at Sekigahara. In the two centuries since, their loyalty to the shogunate has only been skin deep. It's the only thing they have in common with Satsuma. Ah, you're here. Ah, I had a feeling you would come. Let me show you the ropes. It's safer that way. Wander in alone, and you're sure to be ripped off. I've got a feeling I'm going to win big. As long as you let me borrow some of your good luck, that is. Go the dice, folks. Come, place your bets. Come, you finished. Then two and two, even. Well, I had quite a hot hand. How did you fare? Ah, fair enough. It's about that time. Stay too long and you never know what you'll get mixed up in. Hey you! Looks like you're on a roll! Want to share some of your good fortunes? Day. They didn't know what hit them. So, what do you make of the place? There's never any shortage of gamblers to take money from. Come whenever you feel like letting your hair down. See you around.
I've procured some fine wares. What do you want? You know your stuff. Really? Till the next time. Let's have a little chat. No. Oh. Later. I made myself at home. Took you long enough. Traveled far. Anyways, then let's get going. Bound for Kyoto to protect the Shogun, the Roshigumi leaves Edo, its ranks swelled by a full complement of fierce fighters. Meanwhile, the anti Shogunate forces also depart Edo for the capital looking to steal a march on their mortal enemy. Whatever, Mr. Sun. I'm afraid we ain't hugging! How dare you demand a toll? The Choshu clan has urgent business with the Imperial courts. Let us part! We couldn't care less what business you have. If you want to go to Kyoto, you'll have to cough a little something up first. I'm right, I know much for our boys combined, hey? <laughs> Wait till the nobles try to get through here. We're about to be rich. <laughs> Have you heard? 
Seems a bunch of ruffians have taken over the checkpoint. They'll let folks pass in the evening, but not without paying first. We could try to force our way through, of course, but there's a lot of them. We'd risk losing good men. I heard Genzui and his men have made it to the Ejeri post, too. This could be the perfect chance. Listen, the men from Choshu are at the checkpoint as we speak. What say we team up with them and take on those thugs? What? Choshu, you say? The ones plotting against His Excellency? Exactly. If they get wiped out too, we kill two birds with one stone. Huh. Not bad. I'll go and brush the idea. You'd best come with me. What can I say? I'm a genius, right? You don't get it, do you? I'm trying to make Yenzui and the others realize that not everyone on the Shogun side is a bad egg. This is going to work. You'll see. So it's you, is it? It's been a while? Come on, tell me what you're up to. Well, to cut a long story short, we've joined the Roshigomi. But we're stuck here, thanks to those ruffians. I get the feeling we're all facing the same problem. So, how about we team up and teach them a lesson? Kiyokawa, head of the Roshigomi at your service. You must be Kogoro Katsura, master of the Shinto Munendu. Your reputation precedes you. I would gladly join forces with you. Ah, oh, so you are Hachiro Kyokawa of the Hokushin Ittoryu. But you can't expect me to work with the Shogun's men. Ah, don't be so petty. We're in the same boat. We need all hands on deck. Exactly. What's the sense in all of us drowning? All right, I hear you. And no, I don't have any better ideas. The last thing I want is to lose men here. Listen, go and round up Shinsoku and Genzui, will you? I wouldn't want to go into battle without them. Shinsoku said he planned to do some sniffing around the local gambling den. And Genzui just had it out himself. We don't want the thugs getting suspicious. This is a job that demands discretion, and that makes you the perfect fit. And worst case, if those two aren't interested in joining us, we all just need to fight this battle with our current numbers. You petty thugs, trying to profit from our nation's crisis. Let us pass, or we force our way through. Well, you certainly talk big. I know your type. Happy to risk the lives of your men. Sure to end up dying before your time. Ah, so you're here too. You can see how things stand. What's our move? You're right, of course. I'll read this to you two. Show this fellow how hospitable we could be. I will take care of you. Don't you worry. Kusaka, are these gentlemen bothering you? What say we deal with them together? I can do this alone! I don't need help from the road to Look, let's just deal with them first. That's the only way. Gather more hands. 
What were you thinking, facing them alone? Seems he was right about one thing. You're out to die before your time. I don't want my comrades sullying their blaze on the likes of those scum. All I know is getting through this checkpoint isn't going to be easy. What say we join forces? Teaming up with the Shogun's men wasn't part of the plan. But we've got no choice. With swordsmen of your caliber, we'll make short work of them. <laughs> You're quite some fighter yourself, Ksaka. sent you, did he? Well, fear not. We'll head back after a few more games. What? You joined the Roshigumi? Well, no matter. I'm more interested in mixing with the clientele. Take his cutter here. A fine fellow indeed. Not so fast. It's my lucky day. I'm telling you. I'm going to win so big, that Thor will seem like a pittance. What? You would have me join the forces with the Shogunate? I'm honored, flattered even, that you consider me so open-minded. Hey, Takasugi. How about we make a little wager? You and I have ambitions to change the world, am I right? Well, why don't we see which one of us Lady Luck favors? You want to see which one of us is born luckier? Sounds like fun. I accept. <laughs> no hard feelings if you're taken for all you got. Yeah? Down goes the folks. Come, place your bets. You finished? Five and four. Odd. Yeah. Next game. Folks, come, place your you five and two. Odd. Yeah! Next! Another win for them. How curious. Not my day. Folks, come! You finished? Five and six odd! So that's the way of it. You notice too, yes? <laughs> that explains it.
Folks, come, place your bets. Huh? Stop with your ridiculous lies! Some nerve you've got. Don't think I'll let you off so easy. There's neither luck nor skill at play here. Only trickery. to be much of a contest. One thing's for sure. Those thugs are going to be looking out for us. Seems like we got no choice but to team up. You're quite the fighter, Ishikata. Too good to languish in Roshigumi. That's for sure. <laughs> You're not such a bad fighter yourself, you know. Traveled far. All right. Any ideas for how we should strike? My men are fairly rough and ready, so I'll order them to attack head on. Objections? If you're striking from the front, we'll sneak around the back and launch a surprise attack. It's probably best we don't all fight shoulder to shoulder. Very well. It's not like we completely trust the old men either. You can join forces with whomever you choose. You and Katsura go back a fair way, after all. Now, what do you say we take the fight to those ruffians? Good. Only don't get too cocky. No. Who do you plan on joining? I had a feeling you'd say that. Well, let's see you give this all you've got. <laughs> 